Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is uh, <clears throat> dual monitor Ubuntu 19.1. Uh, the whole system just <clears throat> crashed. Uh, I was running Skype. I was running, sorry, I was running Skype. I was running Telegram. I was running Chrome. I was running Firefox. And the whole thing just seized up. <clears throat> Couldn't control the mouse. And uh, mouse was not responding. It's responding now. Uh, but the whole thing just went belly up. And there was no error. No, well, actually, there were a number of error messages up here at the top, but they disappeared very quickly, and I wasn't ca able to catch them. So <clears throat> now let's do uh, the right thing here by con I'm going to go Control Alt. F3, and that's going to give me the login screen. I'm going to put in my login ID and then my password. Now I can say that I've had to do this far too often with 19.1. Um, so what I'm going to do is run. This is rather difficult one-handed, but I'm going to do um, a port and see if tab works. Tab does work. Let's see, a port bug. And I'm going to go with xorg because I'm not quite sure what caused the crash. And now, last time I did this, it literally ran for over 10 minutes uh, and I got no, uh, it just kept running and running and running. So I'm hoping this time a port bug is going to pick up the error log and make, ah, okay, that was much faster, <laughs> much, much faster, thank you. Uh, would you like to da, 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 your display manager like it maybe help developers? Yes. Okay. So I'm going to click yes. And now it's going to my Ubuntu A port account. I've already registered at Ubuntu for, for situations just like this because I can say going ever since going to 19.1, I've had nothing but problems. 1904 was much more stable. I'll pause because you don't want to watch how boring this part is. Okay, it's really, really, really slow. Whatever it's doing is taking its own time. Uh, luckily, I can go back to the GUI. Control Alt F2, and I'm back on the GUI. Now, this is. Uh, Focus 951 um, and Control Alt F3, and it's still chewing on the report. So I'll pause and get back to you after it's done. Okay, still, <clears throat> we're five minutes into it. Control Alt F3 to pull open the terminal view. And you can see that it's still not finished uh, authenticating or doing whatever it's supposed to do. I'm not sure what it's doing at this point. Uh, so it's still not, I'm not quite sure what it's doing authenticating theoretically but it's really slow it's already been at least seven minutes now pausing okay chasing one bug where I lost all of my user interface 19.1 crashed <clears throat> I tried to do the right thing <clears throat> 
by reporting the bug using a port bug. But now I see that a port CLI hangs. Let's take a look at how it hangs. There it is. Still hasn't processed. This has happened before. Now I'm going to, uh, we're in 15 minutes now, so I'm not going to wait any longer. Control C to kill it. Control C, and now I've got uh, Python 3.7, keyboard interrupt. Um, so I don't know if that helps sort out this particular CLI bug, but uh, clearly there's a problem. Let's go back and take a look. Now this A port CLI hangs during prompt for authentication. That's definitely what happened here. So now I'm going to post a bug. This is actually surprisingly uh, old bug. And I'm going to post this video as an attachment so other people will know. <clears throat> Apparently the port CLI does not work. This does not resolve my original problem where I lost all of my usability under Ubuntu 19.1. Thanks for watching and happy computing.